On the 15th of June 2010, the Ropax Ferry Commodore Clipper set sail from Jersey in the Channel Islands towards Portsmouth in the UK. She's a 14,000 ton ferry that can take roll-on roll-off cargo as well as passengers. On this voyage, she was carrying 62 passengers, 39 crew and had cars and freight trailers on her vehicle decks. At 2.42 in the morning of the 16th of June, smoke detector activated on the port side of the vehicle deck. Over the next couple of minutes, more and more sensors activated. There was a fire on the vehicle deck. Now, before we continue, I'd just like to take a moment to thank Fire Aid Academy for making this video possible. Shortly after 3 a.m., with the fire spreading quickly, Commodore Clipper sounded her crew alert and general emergency alarms. Ventilation fans, which feed fresh air into the vehicle decks, were shut down and the drencher system was activated. A drencher system is a bit like a powerful shower. Large pumps send massive quantities of water through sprinkler heads spread throughout the deck. The idea is that it rains water down on any fire that's on the deck. Now, the main issue with drenchers is that the volume of water they produce can very quickly impact upon a ship's stability. 